Welcome. My name is Dale Hovenkamp. I'm the principal here at City High Middle. Today we're going to take a tour of City and you're going to get a chance to go into classrooms as well as to join students as they talk about their experiences here at City. You'll listen in on a conversation that parents are having uh, as well as meet staff and as they discuss our new ventures. We have two new things that we're very excited about this year. One of them is Econometrology, which has been underwritten by the Weggy Foundation and the International Baccalaureate Program, which we will be implementing in the fall of 2009. This year has also brought us recognition in the U.S. News & World Report. This is our second year, and um, we're very proud of this recognition as one of the best high schools in the United States. Staff and students, I think, are aware of that, but it's very nice to get the public recognition Please join us as we tour the building. Um, you'll be able to see classrooms in action. And we hope that uh, you'll join us uh, for a real tour. Yeah, I've definitely learned a lot at City. There's just so many different, like, knowledgeable teachers who just know their subjects, which gives you so much more respect for them. I feel it's very diverse because the school that I went to in sixth grade and before was really just one race, and I wasn't exposed to different kind of, kinds of people. So when I came here, it was an opportunity to get to know more than my race. I think that people like are different at the school and they have lots of different interests and everyone's kind of like accepting of other people. I think City not only prepares you for college and like what you're going to do after high school, but it also prepares you for life after college to get you ready for like the real world instead of being just in high school. Yeah, City definitely prepares you to be more independent. Like, you are able to take care of yourself. There's a lot of people at City who care about the environment in general. It's just, this is a very aware school. At City, we pride ourselves with allowing our students to be active in many activities outside of the normal classroom. We offer, uh, we have an Asian club, we have a French club, we have an Ebony club, which is predominantly for our African American students, but all of our clubs involve all of our students, and we make a big point of saying that these clubs are not closed to a particular ethnic group. So we really try to get our students to look outside of our immediate surroundings at City. We are currently doing a 7th and 8th grade honors science. Uh, the 7th grade is pretty much a physical science, which is an introduction to physics and chemistry at the 7th grade level. And then in 8th grade, we're starting an honors earth science, kind of an honor earth science and an on our earth science. We've always done a lot of outreach within the community, and the children are very interactive in the community, but now our focus is more ecologically sound, I believe, and thinking about our future of our children, their children's future. And we are teaching as a team, literally cross-content area, interglobally, with the Ivy approach, and it's really fun, it's exciting, it's very fascinating. As an educator, I feel very fortunate to be a part of this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and if, I, if it was my kids, uh, my sons or daughters, and I have lots of them, uh, mm -hmm. I would want them to be here. It's Absolutely. It's one of the finest schools in the state. We look forward to you being here. Absolutely. Hi, my name is Gary Frost, and I had uh, twin boys who attended City High from 7th through the 12th grade. Um, they graduated in 2008. Christopher was the um, valid, one of the valedictorians of the class. And um, just a hair's whisker behind him was my other son, Thomas, who is one of the salutatorians of the class. Presently, they are both at the University of Michigan and on the Dean's List. They both mentioned to me that um, the writing that they were required here at City, and although they may not have thought so at the time, once they got into the university, they found out that it's given them a, a real leg up on their competition. They didn't cherry pick any of the classes at all. They tried to pick quite the hardest ones, actually. 
Um, as far as the scholarship at uh, the University of Michigan, they both Thomas and Christopher received um, forty thousand dollars over four years, plus half a dozen other scholarships that uh, that's pretty much paid for the entire um, course of study for four years for them at uh, Michigan. City was instrumental. I that's one thing that I really wanted to do is is to thank the principal here and all the teachers and the staff without their without their help uh, this none of this probably would have happened in the same way uh, maybe I, I can't say enough about uh, about city because it is such a such a, a wonderful opportunity for kids and like I said before I, I thought that um, it may not have been the easiest path for my kids to take but Sometimes the rocky road um, has a, a better ending, and I think that was the case with City. My name is Marsha Hamilton. I'm a parent of a City High student. She's an 11th grader, Augusta Hamilton. And we are not Grand Rapids residents. We are from an outlying area. Augusta was not finding her niche at our old school district, so we started searching around. She, um, as far as the school situation, she, um, she just never really could find enough of a challenge. Uh, my wife had a friend who was a, in the Grand Rapids public school system and, and they got to talking one day and she said, you know, Augusta is a very good student, a bright student, you ought to try City High. Um, and the counseling program here is what I'm just impressed with. We, she's an 11th grader now, so you have to start thinking about the college thing and they lay, have this packet that's just detailed and laid out as far as what tests you need to take, what needs to be done when, and I think she's gonna have a huge choice of what college she wants to go to. I just feel City has been an awesome experience for her. We chose to go to City because of the great academic program as well as the diversity. We actually lived out of district and chose to move to Grand Rapids to ensure that our children would be able to get into City High. At City, I feel my children see other children such as themselves and other families just like theirs that are being successful and that value education. I didn't want my children to feel like they are minorities in a minority culture. I wanted them to know and experience that people of all cultures, races can be successful and value a good education. Something that has, I guess in a sense, bothered me about the Grand Rapids area in general is the negative press that Grand Rapids public schools receive. And I feel like because of that, people don't know about the many gems within the Grand Rapids Public Schools. I think a lot of people look at the public schools sometimes and don't see that there's a real advantage in coming to a school like this With within the, the overall public opportunities that are there. And, you know, there's um, one of the best things, whether it's, you want to look at it as an economic one coming here, the cost to come to this school is very uh, inexpensive. <laughs> you can come to this school and get the best education in town. And as coming from a private school and spending all that money over all those years, all of a sudden here's an opportunity to fall into a school that really I think offers maybe the best education at the best price. My name is Charlie Cameron. I am a staff member at City High Middle working in the English department. I am also the coordinator for our middle years program with the International Baccalaureate Organization. We're beginning with the middle years program and spiraling into the diploma program which will touch on our 11th and 12th grades. When students leave City High, they will leave with an internationally endorsed diploma which we believe will prepare them for the ever-changing global market. Hi, I'm Mr. Schroeder and this is one of City's high school bands.
my name is Belinda Jimenez. I'm an assistant principal here at City High School. I'd like to personally thank you for coming to City High Middle in behalf of all our staff and students. Uh, we truly appreciate your visit and we look forward to many more visitations from you.